Susan Watkins has always been active. I walk a lot. Um, I work out with a personal trainer um, at least once a week. She even loves horseback riding. But last year, she noticed some unusual symptoms while simply walking. I got winded, and I, I knew that that was not normal for me. An echocardiogram revealed Susan's mitral valve was leaking and needed repair. Cardiac surgeon Douglas Murphy says a severe leak like Susan's can take its toll on the heart. That's blood leaking backwards at high velocity. Susan needed surgery to repair the valve. Traditionally, it's been saw the sternum in half and operate from the front of the chest. Now, Dr. Murphy and his team perform the procedure robotically, making five tiny incisions on the side of the patient. If you come from the side, the right side, it's a straight shot to the valve. Then, the surgeon controls the robotic instruments from a console 10 feet away. Because the surgery is much less invasive, it reduces the risk of complications. The number one complication of heart surgery is stroke. We see less than 1% stroke with this. And the recovery is much faster. Susan spent two nights in the hospital and was exercising four weeks after surgery. I'm not even tired. My heart rate's hardly up. I don't have any problem breathing at all, no shortness of breath. Repairing broken hearts for a long and healthy life. I'm Marty Salt reporting.